define American exceptionalism. Does American exceptionalism still exist? And uh, what do we do to grow American exceptionalism? Okay, well, I don't like the term. I'll be honest with you. And I'll, people are going to say, oh, he's not patriotic. Look, if I'm a Russian, or if I'm a German, or if I'm a person we do business with, why, well, you know, I don't think it's a very nice term. We're exceptional. You're not. First of all, Germany's eating our lunch. So they say, why are you exceptional? We're doing a lot better than you. I never liked the term. And perhaps that's because I don't have a very big ego and I don't need terms like that. But honestly, <laughs> when you're doing business, I mean, I watch Obama every once in a while say American exceptionalism. Is, oh. I don't like the term. Because we're dealing, first of all, I want to take everything back from the world that we've given them. We've given them so much. On top of taking it back, I don't want to say we're exceptional. We're more exceptional. Because essentially, you're saying we're more, we're more outstanding than you. By the way, you've been eating our lunch for the last 20 years, but we're more exceptional than you. I don't like the term. I never liked it. When I see these politicians get up with the American exceptionalism, and, and we're dying. We owe 18 trillion in debt. I'd like to make us exceptional, and I'd like to talk later instead of now. Does that make any That's sense? That's good. Oh, because oh. I think you're insulting the world. <laughs> and, and you know, Jim, if you're German, or if you're from Japan, or you're from China, you don't want to have people saying that. Right. I never like the expression. And I see a lot of good patriots get up and talk about America. You can think it, but I don't think we should say it. We may have a chance to say it in the not too distant future, but even then I wouldn't say it. Because when I take back the jobs and when I take back all that money and we get all our stuff, I don't want to rub it in. Let's not rub it in. Let's not rub it in. But I never liked that term. Okay.